So if you're looking to get you a Letitia wig, go ahead and get you one. Cause look at her. <laughs> um, you can't really tell right now. I got I got a few Letitia wigs, but so I recently opened this wig. I think I opened this wig um last month. <laughs> so it's relatively new and I haven't really worn it out much. So that's why it kind of still looks new. Cause I like for my wigs to look like this. Now this is my other Letitia wig. This is how I like for my Letitia wigs to be looking. And I'm gonna put her on in a second so you can see. Oh wait, no, this isn't Letitia. This is a dip, this is Anisha. But I have another Letitia wig that looks a little bit worn. Um, and that's how I like for my, my wigs to look. But I wanted to give this Letitia wig a chance to, um, you know, get to get to explore the world in the way that it comes out the package. So I haven't, um, I have not brushed out any of the curls yet, but I do intend to do that soon. But um, I haven't done it yet. All I did was cut some bangs right here and then um yeah i just cut bangs right here and this is how the wig looked out of the package now got her <laughs> got her she right here okay this is how i like my leticia wigs to look <laughs> all right so um the leticia wigs they are lace front wigs and um as you can see right here i do not have the um, lace on my forehead. I have a little bit of my hairline just pulled out just a little bit. It's not completely pulled out just a little bit. And then I got the wig kind of just sitting there. <laughs> but um, there is some versatility. The bangs are kind of long. Something's happening. Something's happening. Okay. Girl, this wig need to go back a little bit. <laughs> so, what do we think? What do we think? Shoot. I haven't done this, though. I wish that I wouldn't have cut the um, the bangs quite yet so that I could have done like some different hairstyles with the with the front because now it's like too short and I really can't I really can't do all that much I don't think or maybe I can I don't know but if I were to wear it like this then I would just pull out a little bit of hair right here Because I am a, a lazy wig wearer and I don't, um, I don't do all the, the laying to the side and all that stuff. I don't do all that. I mean, laying on, laying the lace on your forehead. I don't do that. Oh, is that a, <laughs> is that a bang? Oh, no, the bang didn't. No, the bang didn't. It's you. You just pull out a little something right here. A little song. I don't got nothing to pull out right now. I got, I got some braids, and them braids ain't really trying to give, give me anything to work with right now. Oh, you said what? Oh, that's just my bang. <laughs> so this is Letitia in a color two. And I'm really looking forward to doing, I want to brush these curls out and I want to see how big it gets with it being long. And then I want to um, trim it and just put layers in it, kind of like this wig. So I'm going to swap out wigs real fast and then you'll see what I did to this Letitia wig. Because this is the same wig, just in a different color. Whew. Okay, so I just threw this on my head. Let's see. So, as you can see, I didn't, 
I done worn this wig. And I love it. So I anticipate that the brown wig, the number two color, will look more like this. Because this looks straight up like um, natural Afro te textured hair with a blowout. This is what this straight up looks like. And you can't tell me otherwise. And this is the T, this is the T-130, the so the, the roots are dark, and then it goes out to like a beautiful light brown color. Y'all can't tell me that Nisha ain't coming together. She ain't coming together. came in here looking a little wild. I'm just spinning in my chair. I'm just spinning in my chair. Oh. Yes. <laughs> oh. Leticia is so much fun. And I just can't wait to get this wig. To take this brown Leticia wig. No, this is not Leticia. Or is it? Okay, girl. But I can't wait to turn this Letitia wig into this type of Letitia wig because, like I said, I want to brush it out like this and I want to do it in phases. So I want to keep it, I want to brush it out and then I want to keep it when it's long. And then I want to trim a little bit, so take it up a couple of notches and then I'll trim a little bit more and then I'll trim a little bit more. Because that's kind of like what I did with this wig. At first when I trimmed it, I trimmed it to like right here and then I trimmed it up here. So I did like two trims and then I, I cut a little bit of layers. Um, but this one I want to do probably like cut a little bit, then cut a little bit, and then cut it up to this point. And shoot, I might even try cutting this wig a little bit more and see what happens. Um, I think that it might turn out nice. It, it would be pretty to even put some more layers in this wig, I think. Because I'm not like a professional by any means, but... I think I am gonna try and like cut some more and then um, yeah cut some layers and then let the curls do do their thing because they're still there they just been brushed out but they still in there somewhere they still in there and this color is so pretty it's so pretty Ooh. Let's see if we can do the swoosh like the other one had the swoosh going. <laughs> y'all say what? Oh, y'all want it? Y'all want it what? Where? And again, if I didn't have the cornrows, then I would pull some hair out and just have it kind of basically be just above the lace because again, I don't like I don't like doing all this. And it's not even so much that I don't like it. I just really don't know how to to do it right. So um, best bet for me is just to pull a little bit of my hairline out and then let the thing just, just go. And that's what I love. I mean, I really love synthetic wigs that are just like they mimic natural Afro textured hair. So even though this hair is straightened, it still... Um, mimics like if my natural afro textured hair was blow dried out or if it had um yeah if I had like it blown out so I appreciate that because if I were to take just a little bit of my hair out it would just blend right on in there
Let's see if I can do the part. I don't know if I can do the part on this one right now. Here it is. So, what do y'all like? Do you like the brown Letitia number two color or do you like the dark roots 30, 30 bottom? I love this one. I want to get this one. I want to get this one again the same color again and then I'm really happy that I got this one too because once I give this one a good cut and play around with it a little bit more this will be just so chill to just throw on and do my thing and still look nice I'm happy because I do this and I've had this wig for over a year I don't wear it um like super often or anything but I have worn it quite a few times. I've worn it out and um, it lasts a long time. So that's Letitia. What would it look like if I, if I do this? <laughs> I've never done this before. That's not what you should do ever. Don't do that. See, and if I would have left the bangs the, the original length, I think that it would be so pretty. It probably would do one of the one of these numbers where it swoops up and then the bangs would go down like that. But see, this could be something too. This could be something. Just get my hairline looking right. That's a whole situation right there. Just I want it what? Just cover that up like this. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, you really do need to get some hair out or something. And that'll be cute. It got a whole little feather situation going. Where is it? Is it right here? I'm looking on my monitor and everything is mirrored. <laughs> <laughs> 